Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, this is going to be my monthly BoxyCharm unboxing. So for those of you new here, I am subscribed to the BoxyCharm subscription box. It is a $21 a month subscription box and you get four to five deluxe to full size makeup products in there. So that is what we are going to be doing today. We're going to be unboxing and trying on everything that I got in my BoxyCharm. So if you are interested in seeing that, then go ahead and just keep on watching. The theme for the box this month is the getaway. That's what the little card looks like. It looks so cute. So the first thing in my box that I got is the No Problem Prime Essence. This is, this retails for $23. So already that is more than the price of the box. So such a great deal. I do have the other the other Touch and Soul primer. I believe I got that in a boxy charm as well. So I'm super interested in seeing seeing what this one feels like. I do like the other one. Ooh, this one sounds like it's gonna be really liquidy. Yeah, it is basically like a water. Ooh, but it feels very nice and hydrating on the skin. Mmm, it smells pretty good too. This primer does feel really nice. I can't wait to try it out more because I think I will really like it. Feels very nice and hydrating on the skin. The next thing in the box that we got this month is the Tarte High Performance Naturals BU Naturally Eyeshadow Palette. And this is what the packaging looks like. It just has like really cute um, purple and blue like palm leaves on it. And then you open it up and they're just all these neutrally eyeshadows. This is right up my alley. I love eyeshadow palettes that are that have a neutral theme to them because I love to wear these just every day. So I'm going to do a quick little eye look with it. I'm just going to be pointing to the shades that I'm using and putting them on my eyes for y'all. Okay, I wanted to go for a really like grungy look today just because I'm feeling kind of grungy. Like I do not look and feel great today. So that's why it's kind of messy. And there was a lot of fallout with this palette. So I will go in and kind of clean up some of that with a makeup wipe. But this palette all in all is really, really nice. It did blend out really beautifully. All of the colors did a really good job I that I used anyways. I didn't really see any problems with them at all. And this palette, let's see here. This palette is $36 if you were just to go out and buy it. So that is an amazing deal. I really do like Tarte palettes. Tarte has some amazing, amazing eyeshadow formulas. So I was, I'm really excited that I got this in the box this month. Um, so the rest of the products that I got don't really go on my face. I just have like a lip product and then one other product to show you guys. And then that's all that I got. So I'm going to quickly do the rest of my face makeup off camera and I will be right back. 
Okay, I have the rest of my face makeup on. I'm going to leave everything that I put on my face down in the description box just because I don't want to get too in depth with what I used in this video since we are focusing more on the BoxyCharm products. So those will be listed down below if you guys are curious. So we're going to move on to the next product that I got in the BoxyCharm, which is the Dirty Little Secret um, Rosy Posy Lip Liner. It's just like a rosy colored lip liner. Um, this goes for $15, and it is a wooden lip pencil boxycharm. It just loves putting wooden lip pencils in their boxes, I swear. I They're not my favorite, but we're going to give it a shot here and line the lips. Okay, so I had that lip liner on. It was kind of hard to use just because it is more of a drier formula. Um, all in all, it's not a bad lip liner. I'm just not overall thrilled with the color and the formula, but it's still a good product to get in the BoxyCharm. And next, I am super excited about this next product. In this box, we got a Dominique Cosmetics lip gloss. This is their let me see here this is their lemonade lip gloss and i got mine in the shade peach tea it's just this really pretty pinky shade and i've been dying to try dominique cosmetics i still this is the very first product that i have that i'm going to be trying out by her so i'm super excited so let's go ahead and just put this on my lips Ooh, it has Ooh, it has a really nice scent to it as well. It smells literally like a baked good. Kind of like, kind of like frosting or like a confetti cake. I have really, really chapped lips today, so this is probably not gonna look the best on me. This gloss is so pretty. I am in love with this. The formula of this is really, really nice. It's not sticky on the lips at all, but it is very, very hydrating. So I'm really liking this. And this is a really pretty summer shade too. I'm super happy with this. And the last product that I got in the box is super exciting to me because I have been really getting into self tanners. So what I got was the Saint Tropez Self Tan Classic. This is the Bronzing Mousse. And this little guy right here goes for $24.50. I have not tried this Bronzing Mousse out before by Saint Tropez. I do have their Daily uh, Moisturizer Gradual Self Tanner in the Watermelon Scent, which is really nice. It's been giving me a nice tan look. So I've been really happy with that. I can't wait to test this out though. Plus, they also sent a little self-tanning mint as well. How awesome is that? I'm super, super excited for to try this out and see how I like it. Let me really quick add up how much this box was worth because we got a lot of really good products in this box. So my box ended up retailing for $115.50 is what all of these products, if I were to go out and buy them separately, that's how much I would have spent. So for $21 a month, that is such an amazing deal. I cannot believe that I got all of these amazing products this month. This box really killed it. There's a lot of good summertime products in here. So yeah, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.